everyone, it's Shalini. Welcome or welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another grad school vlog. It is currently week... It is currently week 11 and it is clearly that point in the semester where I'm losing track of the weeks because they are just flying by. So currently I'm in my second semester out of three semesters of the fifth year mids program at UC Berkeley. I've talked about my first semester a little bit in my previous grad school vlogs. You can check them out right over here. In terms of this semester, I'm taking three classes. I'm taking W209, which is a data visualizations class, W241, which is experiments and causal inference, and W266, which is natural language processing and deep learning. So last semester I was taking four classes and they were definitely more foundational classes for data science. This semester, the classes are much more advanced. They are building off of topics that we talked about last semester, um, but in what I think are new, exciting, and different ways. I personally think that the classes this semester are super interesting. I haven't really come across some of these topics before. Um, so there's been a lot of new learnings this semester so far. So this week specifically is a pretty packed week. Um, we're pretty deep into the semester. It's week 11 out of 14 or 15. We started working on final projects for each class about a month ago, like pretty early in the semester. So I'm currently working on final projects for each of the three classes I mentioned and trying to finish up work related to that. That way I'm ready for the last week of classes, which is when I have to present all of the different projects and you know, like write papers up for all of them as well. So today is Monday, beginning of the week. There are a bunch of things I have to get done specifically today. Um, so for W266, the natural language processing class, me and my project partner have been working on implementing some transformers models and using BERT for our specific task that we're trying to solve. But we're going to go to office hours later today to try and get some clarity around some of the different concepts that we're learning about. I also have live session for my data visualizations class later today. That's the usual weekly live session. Um, but today is a special class because we actually have kind of like midpoint check-in presentations. So each group is going to be presenting what they currently have, so what visualizations they've built so far, what ideas they have for the next coming weeks before the final week of classes. Um, so yeah, I'm probably going to prep a little bit more for that presentation and yeah, let's get on with the week. So it is the end of Monday, so I didn't get to film right after my data visualizations presentation happened um, earlier today, but the presentation went pretty well. Um, we went first, kind of got the presentation over with, which was really nice. Um, we got a lot of good feedback from a professor and also from other classmates um, just on things that we can improve for the final deliverable so we will be working on that later this week and also over the next few weeks before the semester ends we also got a chance to hear the other groups presentations which was really cool because i think all of the groups in our class are doing completely different projects so it's going to be really cool to see kind of the different visualization styles that everyone uses even you know, the technologies and tools that people are using are completely different too. Um, so kind of just playing around with the visualizations at the end through, you know, the websites that people produce are going to, it's going to be really, really cool. So I am very excited for that because today was an initial presentation. So everything isn't finished. We still have about a month left until the final deliverable. So yeah, it'll be cool to kind of see like the starting point of all the groups and see like where they are in a month when the final deliverable comes around. So yeah, it was a pretty productive Monday, super exciting. Hopefully the rest of the week is just as productive with all the rest of the projects I have. So 
So I just finished all my meetings and work sessions and stuff for today, Tuesday. Um, today was thinking a lot about my experiments class and the project that we're doing for that. Um, since we are going to be piloting the survey soon and then actually going out into the field and um, getting respondents and then analyzing the data. So there's a lot that has to be done for that, but we were able to get some clarity from our professor, which was really nice, and then um, work on some of the things that he suggested. But yeah, I think we're making some good progress with that class and that project specifically. I think we're almost done. We're almost ready to pilot our survey to people, which will be exciting to see um, kind of how this crafted experiment survey that we came up with um, does with, you know, real responses and real data. So yeah, that will be happening soon. It is Wednesday. Um, I have a pretty packed day today. Um, I'm working on stuff for all three of my different classes today. Um, first, I have something for my experiments class where um, we are having a meeting with the organization that we're partnering with. So for our specific experiment, we are partnering with an organization on campus and getting, you know, advice from them on how to conduct the treatment and control groups in our experiment. Um, so kind of just having a check-in meeting and showing our survey design as of now, that way they can give some advice and we can keep iterating on our experiment and survey design. I have my 266 or natural language processing class later on today as well. And then in the evening, I have a 209 data visualization work session. So my group is going to basically just jump on a Zoom call and um, keep improving on our dashboard and visualizations for um, our final project. Let's go! Happy hump day! So it is pretty late in the evening. I just finished a 209 work session, which is my data visualizations class. Um, so we had our presentation earlier this week, so we were kind of improving on that initial presentation and basically just working on things we wanted to implement for the final project, for the final deliverable. So we started like putting together, you know, the dashboard and making more advanced versions of our visualizations. And we started to put it all together, which was really cool. Um, we met up in the evening because that was the only time all of us could make it just because, you know, different schedules and everything, but it ended up being a super, super productive meeting. So I'm very happy about that. And yeah, I'm going to head off to sleep and I'm excited for another day tomorrow. It is Thursday, almost to the end of the week. Um, I think I have two main things that I have um, planned for today in terms of meetings and classes and stuff. The first is a paper reading session. So this is for my natural language processing class. It's an extra added on thing on top of the usual asynchronous and synchronous classes and discussions and office hours and stuff. It's similar to an office hour session, except it's slightly reformatted. So we read through an NLP research paper and try to really understand it because a lot of the papers, they are super, super long, very technical and the research process and everything is described in a lot of detail and it can be hard to pick out the main points of the papers so the paper reading sessions are meant to um, guide us through how to read through the papers and understand the concepts a little better and specifically today's paper that we're reading is pretty relevant to the project that i'm working on for this class so I'm very excited to get a better understanding, hopefully, of what the paper is about and 
get some things clarified about the concept as well. And then the second thing I have today is my 241 class, which is my experiments class. Um, that's just the usual weekly live session that we have. Um, specifically today we had an assignment due, so before this I double checked and made sure that I submitted everything properly. I've been working on that assignment for the past few weeks. Yeah, just double checked that everything was submitted and all good on that front too. Let's get on with the day. It's Friday, it's the end of a pretty busy week. Earlier today I had a check-in with my data visualization group and professor so we could try and get some clarity on certain feedback that was given to us earlier this week after our presentation on Monday. Overall, I think looking at everything, I think this week was pretty productive. Because it's week 11, there is a lot to do for each of the three classes I'm in. Um, we're coming really, really close to the end of the semester, so there is a lot to do for each of the projects in preparation for the final week of classes, which is when I will be presenting each of the final projects along with my respective groups. As always, thank you so much for watching. Make sure to check out some of my other grad school vlogs. Last semester, I did a few vlogs which highlighted my first semester of grad school. I also make videos about technology, data science, professional development advice, and more, so make sure to check all of those out. I also have a series about women in tech called Tech Girl Thursdays, so definitely check that out as well, and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye!